How high? It's there. And there's a bit monkey. Oh, hi, it's there, and we're back doing some of our Lego. Uh, and we'll go back to another, another episode of Dare Lego Chronicles. Uh, I'm the Schwann, of course, and here we are back unboxing some more unboxing some more Lego. Which we'll be unboxing this as well as two more as well as two more mysteries. A figure and I think like three more. I'm looking at three more sets of, uh, as well as those guys, which you can't see until I do this. There you go. See all of that, all of that. Yes, indeed, I got for Black Friday for probably less than a thousand, all told. Hopefully, less than a thousand, all told. And, um, yeah. Ah. Uh, excuse me, sorry, I'm just probably tired. I'm trying to. These paper towels in my, in my setup always fail me. They always do. Okay. Sorry, uh, I didn't. I didn't quite plan recording, but I kind of need. Uh, but the, but this came in, so I kind of need to unbox it because I can't leave it like this. Because well, I mean, I guess I can. No reason not to, but I really want to. I really want to see what's what's inside. I got a little peek just to see. I well, I opened it because I opened all the things I get because I wanted to see if it was in fact random. If they were just shoved in there or do they have actual foil for the mystery but no 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 they're just shoved in there as we'll see in a second with a mace wind with a mace window i'm pretty sure that's mace window anyway and a these are the two limited mysteries for black friday or as my grandma says good friday like from Lego Empire, and oh wow! Who are you? That is a good question. You know, I should have know this guy, but I don't know this guy. But yeah, and as you can see, they come in real sealed, uh, resealed official Lego stuff. Come the two blasters as well. Very nice. Should be it. Yes. So let's quickly assemble these guys, and then in another clip, I'll go over all the sets I got from I got from a lot of places. Amazon, which I have all the Amazon stuff. Target, I have all the Target stuff. Lego.com, I only have one of them stuff. And of course, two, and of course, the three more things from Lego Empire, which has a YouTube channel, which I'll link in, which I'll link in the description too, I guess. And um. Yeah, they're really high quality. Now, I don't know if these are UV printed or pad print, printed, but they are actually really, really nice. Especially since each of these cost $7. Like, you can't get a custom figure that looks nearly this nice unless you go to um, Amazon and look hard. Uh, you can't get a figure this, that looks nearly this nice for around for, for around for under $10. Usually they cost more than $20 $30. I believe that's what these guys probably retail as on his site. Money a 30, but anyway. So yeah, actually I'm more uh, yeah, let's say it makes me new for last. Oh wait. Wrong boxing Lego. Hold it. Hold it hold it hold it hold it hold it. That's it, I guess. Alright, now we can unbox everything without having it spill over into the void. Uh, I can just stay there.
Excuse me. We sealed. Wiggle bag's always nice. And this is even a recent Lego bag. It's kind of hard to tell. Whoops. There we go. It comes with a bunch of guns for this price. Yeah, just standard jingo head or clone head. Although it is a darker complexion, which it actually should be. I want to say these are UV printed because I can fill it with my nail. It is a sim. Well, that's not official legal torso. Yeah, that is very much an official legal torso. Come on. There we go. Not official legal head. Nor helmet. They're not official legal head either. That's fine. I wasn't expecting it to be. And those are red legs with white printing. And they, actually, the white printings actually came out really, really nicely. And it has some defects, but again, for $7 mystery, like, you can't really go wrong. It comes with everything separate, which is nice in its own way. Clip arms are my bane. You can also feel uh, it's not Lego with the plastic either. Just to feel the plastic. Again, that's fine. Wasn't expecting it to be actual Lego for this. Wasn't expecting it to be genuine Lego for this price. Or I can lose it regardless. Because arms are a pain. There we go. So many hands, too. My pieces are really loose, but I'm used to, you know, all, I'm used to pieces that are on the right spot. May not put the visor on. But I'm used to old Lego anyway. I mean, I'm used to old Lego, so, yeah, and there's a difference. Like, they go that from 20 years ago. They go that are from 20 years ago. So I'm really nauseous right now for some for some reason. For really no reason. Because I'm always nauseous for no reason. I'm never nauseous for a reason. Yeah, man. But no, like the, the printing is actually really, really nice. The printing is actually really, really nice. Don't know what I'm whispering. Come on. Yeah, it's my first time putting on the visor. Come on. There we go. Much better. I already know about one of these. And nearly as high quality as the one on my 
As though, oh God, my, oh my hands are cramping up. Not nearly as high as quality, as same high quality as the one on my Sig Fig, but the one on my Sig Fig also costs more than this pack. More, more than one of these packs, so. Actually, more than both of these packs combined. Oh, yeah, I mean, like, the mission, uh, the mission statement of, of LEGO Empire is to, ha is to allow people to collect, to make, uh, oh, come on, I had it, is allow people to collect, a, a, or, yeah, to amass a LEGO, to make, uh, to amass a LEGO army for cheap, and yeah, yeah, for, yeah, you can, and y'all have be very happy with it. From what I can tell. No, oh, come on. Yeah, this may be the only video in this. Actually, no, no there's going to be another part. There's going to be another part to this because I got the 20th anniversary of the Clone Wars and plaque in it as well from the legal UCS Finiter. There we go. That cheap all works. It still runs. I got I got use for you. I have a use for that one. Let's give you two pistols. I do like the assortment of weapons that, 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 that this man has. And these are more lore accurate versions of the machine guns that are given that are with other legal uh, that are, are official that legal uh, that legal officially has. Let's just put you on there for the sake of argument. Go. Oh. And, and we have an extra hand, which is nice. I always need more hands. Extra, uh, extra um, scope. Two extra pistols and an extra and an extra carbine. Very nice. Now it's time for good old Miss Windu. I want to get the target tank now. Hmm. <laughs> right, so there we go. Oh, there we go. Uh, this one comes mostly assembled. Again, really, really nice detail. What's the main color of the pants? Brown. A uh, hood, I guess. No cape, though. Yeah, really press arms in such a in such a way. Oh no, Kate, because this is the the Clone Wars version of Mace Window. There we go. One of his arms up so you can see the side detail. And again, the, the light printing on the dark printing is good. It, it's better than what you like with us officially. The lightsaber is bringing back memories because it's a lot like an older lightsaber that I'm more used to. And then you got an extra hand and a hood. Might as well put the hood on. Whoops, I was the wrong way. That's the thing.
So yeah, that's our guys. Uh, that that's what we got for around um, seventy uh, for well seven plus seven for around uh, thirteen dollars. Not bad, not bad, especially since like if you were to get a much higher quality of this of these guys, you have to pay thirty uh, for for pad printing all around and whatnot. Like that would cost you a lot more than what these guys are. And yeah, they're, they're honestly pretty good. What a price! Come on, give me. Let me, let me at your head. Thank you. I got, I got straight up the hood. So if you just want to collect certain characters that are cost prohibitive in actual Lego or never, or never existed to begin with, or are too outdated for you, then yeah, go ahead and check out uh, Lego. Go ahead and check out Lego. Uh. Go ahead and check out Lego. Lego Empire. Oh yeah. And also one last thing before we wrap up. I am going to give you another overview of all the Lego sets and be, I am going to um, put the plaque where it belongs, which means I, I'm going to need your stand. Uh, you didn't see that. That didn't happen. Uh, I guess it did happen. We need that. All right. All these from the mess. So we're gonna need you. So I got this guy, the little Lego 31 Crater Shuttle, and then the rest are going to be hard to get at, but I got Ice Floor Mario, at least that's what I call him. Got a guitar, I'm always going to get back here. Got the Brickhead Soka. Got Bonsai Tree, which we'll build soon, hopefully they will see. Got Luke Skywalker Head. Got the Dodge Charger, also known as... Fast and Furious Dom, <laughs> um, Battle Pack, also got Pizza's Castle, and the uh, SLS, also known as Rocket Lodge Center. But that's not all either, um, they don't do Christmas Street. But that's not all either, I also am getting... I'm also getting in the Lego Star Cruiser. Let's see how fast this goes to these glasses go to not. Oh, there we go. No, it's not doing it. No, that's unfortunate. At least it gets the glare in my eyes. So for you, I was planning to put the 2x4 brick, I was planning to put the 2x4 brick there, but as you can see, that's not happening. Oh die camera, oh die. No, that's not going to work. That's going to work. We're just unboxing on this channel, Zova.
And they did send an ice machine, which is nice. You don't. Ah, it's falling. Stuff is falling. There you go, fresh from a cellar, which I like, probably, we'll see. And you notice it's not a, you notice it's not a one by two, it's a one by four, which is a problem. But we have the solution. Just printing it on a black um, one by four, really tall one. It's the 20th anniversary of the Clone Wars, which I thought would go nice with the thing. I was coping with not having the um, the vinegar. There you go. Hopefully, you could see any of that. Wait, I, wait, we gotta do another thing. But wait, there's more. We gotta have the leader of the detachment. We gotta have the leader of the ground forces. The general, or the clone commander of the ground forces. Uh, that's not gonna happen. Again. Become the tree. Become the tree. Just messing with the clone here. Getting him in position. And these guys could use guns, but fortunately we have them. But you know, that is the part of the core complete pretty much, except the guys could use guns. Well, let's go get them their guns. Uh, running out of time on this camera. We are back. Don't you love cross compatibility? Like that he that helmet, it works. It, it, it's a little tight on the fit, but it works. And that's from uh, that's from um, Clone Armor Customs. Again, the uh, the scanners from the sca again the scanners from now again the sca sorry my arm is getting tired. Again, the scanners from Lego Empire. Or probably somewhere else. Come on. There we go. And yeah, it works perfectly fine. Because it's all Lego. And, the, and then there, those are the Clone Army Custom. I mean, those are the Lego Empire guns. That could be official Lego like, guns. Who knows? Uh, and probably the Empire does. Uh, in the hands of a 20 year old clone. A 20 year old, 20 year old clone pilot. And yeah, I'll I'll have a picture. I'll I'll give you a picture of all of all of it looking really really pretty with my semi song that I want to upload to um, to DeviantArt as well as 
it's that I already you know the instructions for two for the V3 versions of this guy. This is essentially the V1 and V2. It's I mean you can always you can always modify the, the V3 to look like to look this way, but it would just be it's just pre prohibitively expensive to build this guy. Um uh, uh like like my target audience like like um I mean, while the instructions are like six dollars, it, it would be too much to actually build this guy a fish. Uh, build this guy for most people. I think you just want to have a set that will be cheaper than. Um, I mean, it's still cheaper than the executor, and definitely the and definitely the um what you call it the the UCS vendor, but still. I, I really do enjoy it. I really really do enjoy it. Now that it's all, now that it's all done up. And actually, you, you can find Republic officers nowadays. Uh, it's just I keep forgetting where they are. Uh, and why why didn't why get a new why get a new Lego when you could just use your old one, the old fleet officer for the Empire. Oh yeah, no. Like, I really, really like how this looks now. It, it just came out so well, but anyway. Alright, so that'll be it for, for this video. Thanks for watching. I appreciate watching. This video means a lot to me. It also 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 means a lot And by sharing your friends and this channel. Alright, that'll be it for you. Thanks for watching. And I guess, and also... Well, and also I'll show more of the Lego sets when they come in, when they come in, especially if I start building them and look, it makes me do it off in the distance all by himself. We'll have the, we'll, we'll put them, we'll put them in, we'll, we gotta find a good spot for me to do. I guess we're on there. No way. That'd be it for Thanks for watching. And I guess, oh wait, yeah, no, I'm going to do a new, I'm going, uh, I'm going to do a clip where, I'm, I'm going to do a clip where I show you just the pretty photo, probably with me new in between. <laughs> Or somewhere, uh, somewhere around here, somewhere around my good cabinet. Um, but anyway, all right. To be right back.